Hey, Connor here at Neversink Farm, and I'm in the family garden, and today it's uh, finally a warm day here in the Catskills. And I was going to plant on some pumpkins. My son River is obsessed with growing some pumpkins. Uh, me and him started these probably a few months ago, a couple of months ago, it feels like. Uh, it's been a long, cold spring. And then I have uh, green beans, which has started and I'm gonna put them next to the trellis I just put up. Uh, the pumpkins are gonna try something new this year in the garden. Because they take up so much space if they start crawling around on the ground, I'm gonna try to just start tying them up the stick frame, which I was growing green beans on last year. And so I'm going to select pumpkins. So as they start to fill out, I'm going to pinch off and try to grow just maybe six to 10 pumpkins on it and keep them limited. So I don't want this thing to fall over. Uh, I never did it before, but I, I'm hoping it's gonna work and look really nice. So I wanna find a place for it that's gonna look good. I was thinking maybe at the end of the, right at the end of this row maybe, uh, I was gonna set it up. So I'm gonna set that up first and then I'm gonna start planting. So it actually took me a little while to figure out where I wanted it. I was kind of looking over here or over there. But uh, I think next to the green beans and the peas, I think it's going to be good. I don't know how confident I am on, on it being sturdy enough to hold a few pumpkins, but hey, we'll see. We'll have a good time. I can always uh, reassure it with another stick going forward. Okay, so now I'm going to go grab the green beans. I'm going to plant them right on this trellis here that I just put up, which uh, I know is gonna hold. I've been using a trellis like this for many years. So I'm gonna go get those. All right, so these I just plant one or two beans per cell. I'm probably gonna plant them pretty close, maybe a hand's distance apart. I'm just gonna, since I'm already digging, I might as well give it a little bit of nitrogen.
Okay, so I have four beautiful pumpkin plants that are ready to go in. I'm going to plant one by each stick. So they're in the ground and I think in about a week, once they're established, I'm going to start to tie them up and tie them to uh, the stakes using some uh, jute. They're going to keep growing. We're not going to get pumpkins until late summer, early fall at least. And these are for carving and or eating. I know my son River just wanted the carving kind, but I think it'd be nice to be able to have, cook some pumpkins as well. So I'm going to give them their first tie up and on the way I'm going to, I'm going to just rub out these, these are like uh, little flowers. I want this thing to get a bit more strength before it starts flowering. Alright, and again on all of these ones. 